So with this, I'd like to uh, go to the next uh, speaker from Iran. I want to introduce Farshid Hendi. He's the corporate development director of the Rahnama company in Iran and is uh, active more than 15 years in the IT businesses. Uh, I just want to mention that this is one example of an industrial group that has been very successful in other parts, and then now they come and expand it to high tech. There's a lot of potential for various industries which right now are established in Iran to actually move to high tech due to the significant resources that they have. This is an important one to keep in mind. Uh, I would like to ask Mr. Hendy to come to the podium. Thank you. Hello, everybody. Uh, I'm Farshid from Rahnama Company, Tehran. Uh, my concern today is uh, how to demolish the bridge. Uh, but uh, before that, I'm going to tell you the story of myself over the bridge. Two islands exist on, the, on two sides of the bridge. One old Fangal Island with inhabitants of uh, commerce, EPC contractors, bankers, financial financial person, and some person from semi-governmental organizations with lots of money. Okay. Please. On the other side, New Fangel Island, at where me and three of my friends were living alone. This is about 15 years ago. So not many people lived there. By then, we were young but curious about internet. So we found a gentleman from Old Fangal Island, a chairman of one of top five home appliance companies. Luckily, we had the chance to collaborate and establish a successful business. No, there are many people living in New Fangal Island. For example, e-commerce companies, on-demand services companies, internet and mobile-based businesses, sharing economy companies, game and application developers. Now looking at the two islanders in comparison with different point of view. First, about character of islanders. As startups play main role in newfangled while mature companies in old fangled. Pay attention that uh, what differentiates startups and small businesses is growth rate. Transparent behavior of newfangled islanders is against the level of security and conservative mode of the other side. Furthermore, passionate Newfangled Islanders present themselves in front of wise veterans. On right side, we have conventional Islanders who has been trying to secure their, their position when left side, Islanders been connected to each other by new technologies and new science. What's more, the capitalists are seeking for talents when talented chase for someone invest on their ideas. After that, I'm going to differentiate these two islands from business point of view. New Fangal Island, New Fangal Islanders approach is product oriented, while old Fangal are sales oriented. They look at what market required, but left side look at for innovative solutions. Best newfangled are measured by their value when the other side by profit. Moreover, newfangled success ladder lean on future. 
Yet, old-fangled success ladder stands up on their roots. No new question is asked. What the bridge is made of? Pillars. As we all know, pillars are a bridge, are the foundation, and without them it cannot be stable. The first main pillar is uh, private funds, which collect old fangled money to invest on new fangled ideas. The second one, we have accelerators and incubators that mentor and help startups to create value for themselves and for investors. And the third, startups, young, passionate, talented from Newfangled Island who has great ideas to be developed. On the pillars, subsequently, value exchange a stream over the bridge. These values vary between services, money, new products, etc. And all speech today are about these values. This is the main slide of my speech. We need to focus on aspects that demolish the, our bridge. <coughs> Firstly, <coughs> sorry. Firstly, if private fund do not pay attention, that it is venture investment. It's a different from bank investments. It may fail or it may rise. Secondly, accelerators should not overconfidently overvalue startups because it can make fake bubbles in business. And thirdly, startups should be aware of worth of money. And that is not a favor done by investors. They must create real value in business. Finally, there should be a lingua franca language developing between all parties to speed up value exchange between uh, two islands, which without it, communication is impossible. In the end, notice that I choose demolish instead of destroy because dictionaries, dictionaries said demolish means cannot be repaired. All the best for all of you. Thank you.